Global Port endured the absence of the suspended Mo Tatua to frustrate Miralco, 8685, and barge into the win column of the PBA Commissioner's Cup on Friday night at the Smart Araneta Coliseum. Stanley Pringle took over when called upon, firing 13 of his 17 points in the payoff period, where the Batang Pier held off a late rally by the Bolts to atone for an opening day loss to TNT Catropa. The Batang Pier, who were down a big man after Tatua was suspended for a flagrant foul on TNT import Jeremy Tyler, handed the Bolts their first loss after their opponents opened with a win last Wednesday. A win is a win, we'll take it, Global Port coach Pito Gerencio said. I commend the last group. Malcolm White anchored the attack with 25 points, 17 boards, 2 blocks, and 1 assist in 43 minutes, while Sean Anthony also delivered with 17 points, 7 rebounds, and 2 assists, that made up for 6 turnovers. But it was Pringle who carried the offensive load in the fourth quarter, scoring a layup that gave the Batang Pier a 77-69 lead halfway through the period. That cushion was enough to withstand a late run by the Bolts led by Nino Canelta, who fired a game-high 28 points, including seven triples, before Chris Newsom scored on a floater that pulled Moralco to within one, 82-83. Pringle scored the Batang Pier's last three points, all from the foul line, to negate an inconsequential triple by Newsom at the buzzer. Cannell led a Drew support from a Rinzanyu Aku who chipped in 21 points, 14 caroms, three assists, two steals, and one block, but little from the rest of the locals. The scores. Global Port 86, White 27. Pringle 17, Anthony 15, Arana 7, Nabong 6, Gray 5, Tang 3, Ellard 2, Gabani 2, Vierns 2, Ginto 0, Sergeant 0. Moralco 85, Canaletta 28, Onyaku 21, Karam 9, Newsom 9, Amer 8, Hodge 6, Hugnaton 2, Salva 2, Dillinger 0, Sejarifa 0. Quarter scores, 23-25, 45-44, 63-65, 86-85.